This is day one of Wisco Whitewater mountain bike race for the collegiate season. We're in Whitewater, Wisconsin, Alpine Valley Ski Resort. And we are heading out to the cross country race for today. It's gonna be our only race. And then we're gonna have uh, hopefully some sessioning on the downhill lakes this afternoon. So that should be pretty fun. So, and I'm trying to not get lost in here. All right. So we're gonna have to make sure that we're staying really, really hydrated throughout the day. We're about to go hit up breakfast right now and go find a little cafe to get some food in and then prep up for race at 11 o'clock. Cole, are you ready to dine like a princess? Oh yeah. <laughs> All right, so uh, after some hasty, oh, hold on, after some hasty getting ready, we are good to go and sending it out for the crew getting warmed up here. Should be a should be a pretty good race. Looking forward to it. Well, that sucked. <sighs> Um, God, it's so hot. That was so hard. I had a really, sh just really bad start. Like, we started really, really quickly. I just wasn't ready for it. So, I kind of missed my pedal and I didn't really like get the pop that I wanted to off the line. So I ended up uh, fifth. There was like, I think it was Caleb and Ben, and then two people and then me, or three people. Yeah, three people and then me, so, so I was sixth. Math. Um, and ended up that uh, our big contender he flatted on the first descent and on the rocks, so that was pretty good. It was just like, I mean, it was unfortunate to see, but it bumped all of us up one spot. And then I was just kind of sitting patient. I let Ben and Caleb take off. I was just sitting behind the other two riders, let them kind of do their thing. I knew they weren't like very good in terms of. Uh, in terms of technical ability, so I was just waiting, and then, you know, sure enough, one by one, that each of them just made a mistake, and then just I was able to attack and get around them and just, you know, break the break the elastic, just because they were they still had a foot down while I was getting on the gas. So overall, it was good, and then at that point, I caught up Ishmadi and Caleb. Uh, Caleb was gassed from doing the cross race yesterday, so. Props to him, he had a good ride. I think just the heat just overtook him. And then, you know, of course, obviously Schmuddy was off to the races. So I was sitting pretty in second, just focused on not making any mistakes and just surviving for the rest of the day. But, uh, yeah, that was it. It sucked, it hurt, but we go one, two yet again. So I can't complain about that. I don't really like very neat, but I might get a salad. A salad? A salad. <laughs> <laughs> the two ninety nine. Sure we have to have your skinny. I mean, honestly, yeah. Alright, we're back up and at them. It's day two and we are awake. Got about two and a half hours before race start, so we're gonna go get some breakfast and uh, start packing everything up, getting out of the room and uh, head over to the venue site. Fortunately for us, the venue is right here at the hotel, so uh, we have a pretty nice spot and we're gonna just kind of chillax until we need to start warming up and getting ready here. Nice. Yeah, they're just gonna fog up the No, they're not. That's only if it's cold. <laughs> gonna drill some holes in there. Well, if you could find a spin, look, I have a lot of shit. All right, but this works. <laughs> <halfway around. laughs> I got you. Anybody wants to hurt anybody, aim for that guy. He got that gate. He got that gate. Oh, ho, ho. Somebody said, Yeah, Shane. Yeah, Nate. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. We have one hour till race. I believe that is, as they say, it's go time. <laughs> 